Alex and also Marcus as well. We're here today to present or request for £200,000 for a 10% stake in our company. The £200,000 will be split between spent as shown as on the board. Um, it's just an approximate breakdown as per if we was to get that investment, what we would do with it exactly. I'm just going to pass it over to Raj Hi everyone, thanks for um, having us. So just quickly, um, I'm not sure much about Alzheimer's disease. It's a growing problem in the UK and around the world. There's about 850,000 people in the UK uh, with the disease. Um, and it's a regressive memory disease, which basically means you go back to a previous time in your life. There are other cheap guess solutions out there, as uh, I'm sure you can guess. However, these fail for a number of reasons. You have, the person has to use them. If they've never seen this device in their life, when they revert it back, it's useless. And they have to be aware they're in a situation of harm or in danger, so it fails on this. So, we've created an insult. The idea is that everyone in this room like, guarantees wearing a pair of shoes, wearing a pair of shoes tomorrow, the day after, the next 10, 15 years of your life, and so on. So, no matter how far they regress, they always have the habit of putting their shoes on, so we went for an insult. So I'm not going to go through all of the features there, but um, we've got GSM, so it connects to the network. It doesn't need any third-party device to work. It has GPS obviously for location. The other cornerstone of our product is that it cannot break that person's routine or habits. So we've got wireless charging, so the idea is we come back from outside or carer, can place the insult inside the shoes onto our charging pad, so we can charge inside the shoes. And we've also got an accelerometer, which makes it very unique, because we can also go on to track gate cycles, detect falls and all the other stuff around movement and motion.